A Peach County school program is helping bridge the generation gap between grandparents and grandkids. In today's Education Nation story, 41 NBC's Melissa Lee introduces us to a program called Grandparents as Parents, or GAP. It's different without a mom. Vaquan Wright looks to his grandmothers. But I still call grandma mom too. As mom and dad. It's just like I was raising my own. Vaquan's grandmothers, Annie Wright and Verlene Ballard, are sharing the parenting role. I love them to death. And anything I can do for them, I do it. They play a different role because they're not just grandparents on weekends. They have them every day. They are actually raising their grandchildren, um, and they have them all the time. With the help of a program called Grandparents as Parents, Ballard and Wright are bridging the generation gap within their family. The program to me, um, to me, has brought um, us closer with our grandkids. The monthly meetings include guest speakers. We've had people from DFACS come in to actually let them know what their rights are. Tips for parenting. We've had attorneys come in and talk to them um, about what their rights are. So uh, we try to give them all the information we can to help them in this new um, venture that they're on. And a chance to mingle with other families. Get to know other people in their situation and you'll think, well, your situation is like mine. Their situation may be unique, but that doesn't change how Vaquan treats his grandmothers. I treat them with respect. Or how they treat him. He's a treasure. In Fort Valley, Melissa Lee, 41 NBC News. GAP started in 2008 to provide support for those grandparents raising their grandchildren. The program now has more than 50 participants.